The adrenaline he felt when getting behind the wheel, customizing a car to his liking, and driving at high speeds was incomparable to anything else. It was his passion, and danger did not intimidate him, he preferred not to use a stunt double for the action scenes in his movies, especially when he had to drive a vehicle. Unfortunately, it was in this way that Paul Walker would meet his untimely death at the age of just 40. Before we dive in, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications to stay up to date with our updates. On November 30, 2013, the world lost one of its beloved and charismatic actors, Paul Walker. Known for his iconic role as Brian O'Connor in the successful film franchise, Fast and Furious, his death shocked millions of fans around the globe. The tragedy occurred in Santa Clarita, California, when Walker, who was 40 at the time, was in the passenger seat of a Porsche Carrera GT, owned by his friend and business partner, Roger Rodas. The car crashed violently into a lamppost and a tree, causing an uncontrollable fire that left both occupants trapped. Despite efforts to extinguish the fire, nothing could be done to save their lives. Walker was in the process of filming the seventh installment of the franchise when he was unexpectedly taken. Producers enlisted his brother, Cody, to stand in for him in some scenes that had not yet been shot, thanks to their physical resemblance. It was a time of distress and desolation. Spirits were not at their best, but they resolved to complete the film as a kind of tribute to him and, of course, not to forfeit the millions of dollars invested. His departure caused profound sadness among his colleagues, family, and admirers. Meadow, his daughter, lived through this ordeal. Immediately, along with her lawyers, she launched an investigation to determine the cause of the accident. At the time, there were speculations of mechanical failures. A year later, the courts dismissed the speculations and found that the accident occurred because Rodas was driving at more than 90 miles per hour when the posted speed limit in that area, indicated on road signs, was 45 miles per hour. The death of Paul Walker was an immense loss to his loved ones, his fans, and the film industry at large. Despite his tragic departure, his memory endures through his cinematic work. Paul Walker, a passionate and altruistic actor, will always be remembered with affection and admiration. If you are new to our channel, do not forget to subscribe. Do not forget to follow us on all our social networks, which will be here below in the description. Remember, history is the memory of time, and the warning of the future.